Hey everyone, so in part two of the nine month vlog, I've got a lot of like videos where I just filmed myself doing things, um, more so than like a talking video where I update you guys about my skin. Um, just because my skin was doing really well and I didn't really have much issues. Um, so yeah, so here's me showing you guys what I got from the natural supermarket that I found in Shinjuku Sanchome in Tokyo and all these biscuits were gluten free, refined sugar free and dairy free so it was like my dream supermarket um, yeah so if you ever go to Tokyo check it out it's called um, Bioraru in Shinjuku Sanchome so today me my sister and our cousins we went to this place called spotcha and it's a place where you can do sports they have like games and you like um you pay for like three hours and you get to play wherever you want for three hours it was so much fun it really felt like we were kids again we were just having fun and not worrying about anything else There was once a day that I would pray for you, I'd go We are back in Tokyo. Look how pretty these lights are. It was before Christmas, so they had a lot of these light ups going on. So today we decided to do hot pot. Um, I like to use soy milk as a base sometimes it's nice and creamy and there's this shop that my grandma goes to buy tofu and it's a tofu only shop so they have freshly made soy milk every morning um so that's what we're using today and it's the freshest soy milk I've, i'm gonna ever have so i wanted to show it to you guys and it was so so creamy Good morning everyone so Recently, I've been waking up with a weepy chest and um, I wake up with the t-shirt stuck on my chest because of the dried up um, liquid. And it feels so disgusting and I just like pull it off and my t-shirt's wet and yeah, it's just, I hate it so much. Um, and I get like a little weepy area like here every morning but other than that it's okay and my eyebrows starting to grow back a little bit so yeah hey guys a long time no update but it's my nine months TSW anniversary so the last few weeks I was in a good skin phase so my skin was pretty clear and um, I had I had less flakes and less flares and um, I was enjoying my clear skin phase but from like a few days ago um, maybe like a week ago I've been experiencing intense itchiness around my chest to my shoulders so like this area here including my neck just like here and it's like a really really intense itch and i can feel that it's like a nerve um itch and when you scratch that itch it feels so freaking good and it gets addictive but i know that it's going to make it worse and it's going to weep after i scratch so I, like i try not to but it's so hard to stop myself from scratching because i know how good it's going to feel so and um it gets itchy towards the night so yeah every night i've been fighting the itch i try and distract myself by watching youtube and um 
I use the ice pack as well when it gets really, really itchy because sometimes when the itch is a pretty mild one, I try not to use the ice pack as much because sometimes when I um, take the ice pack off, it gets even more itchier than it was before. So I only use the ice pack when the itch gets really, really intense. I want to sh show you guys how my chest look lo looks like. Um, but I don't have any like sports bras. I didn't bring any to Japan because it's winter. So uh, let me just show you guys like this. Can you see how weep, like how weepy it was? Yeah, it gets worse at night. Ideal. During my clear skin phase, my face was doing so well. Like, at one point, I had no flakes at all, and it was so nice to have no flakes and no... And it wasn't itchy at the time, so that was really nice. And honestly, like, during my nine months of TSW, I honestly, like, forgot how I used to look like, and my flaky like sometimes flared up skin was the new me like in my head and and when I had no flakes at all during my clear skin phase I saw myself in the, I saw myself in the mirror and I remembered what I looked like before so that was really really nice and um I really saw the light at the end of the tunnel but then after that, my chest started to flare up and, well actually, like, I don't know if I should say flare up because it, it started getting itchy and I scratched it so then it became weepy and now it's like this. So it wasn't like it flared up in the beginning, it was because um, I scratched the itch and the itch was like not like my normal itch that I get. That's how I usually get into like my new flare cycles. I don't get it straight away. Like I don't get like red, um, like, you know, flit, flared up skin. I get really itchy. Um, and yeah, so then my face started to become um, flaky as well. But this side of my face is doing all right. And my eyebrows are starting to come back after so long. Remember how I lost my eyebrows for the first time? And then they grew back pretty quickly. But then they fell out again. And then they they grew back. And then they fell out again. And then from the second time it fell out, it took a long time to grow back. It's finally growing back. You can see like this but he's getting darker. So yeah, it's finally growing back. And the this side of my face got really itchy last night and I rubbed it a little bit, so it's flaky today. My stomach used to have no symptoms at all, but recently it's been getting itchy and my back is okay still. It's just my stomach and my legs doing really well. It's healed up really well. But it does get itchy. And I found that um, my skin's getting stronger, like I said before. Especially my legs, because I, it gets itchy and I scratch them. But they don't, like, cause much damage. Today is the 22nd of december it's christmas in three days on christmas eve um i'm gonna have a christmas party with my boyfriend's family and on christmas day i'm gonna stay at an airbnb with my boyfriend for three days so i'm really excited um yeah well that was my nine months update I hope that this flare won't be as bad as my previous ones and that I my skin will bounce back 
quickly and that by the time I go back to Australia in February my skin will be okay because it's going to be hot by the time I go back and I'm going to have to show my skin and in Japan everyone wears a mask so I wear a mask outside and it covers up most of my skin so it feels um, comfortable going out but in Australia no one wears them anymore so hopefully my skin will heal by then. That was the update. I hope you guys have a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. Thanks for thanks so much for watching my nine months vlog and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!